I hear a lot of people comparing Gunna and Takashi 6 ix 9 You know what I'm saying? Don't mind me. I, I, I got it out because, you know, I got the thing going and I don't want to do that on YouTube. So that's why we in the dark right now. But anyway, I hear a lot of people comparing Takashi 6 ix 9 to Gunna. And I need y'all to not disrespect Takashi 6 ix 9 like that. Uh, now, now he's a rat and he gets like uh, the lowest of the lowest respect. But if there's anything lower... Then uh Takashi 69 rat. Huh? If there's anything lower than a rat like Takashi 69, it's a rat like gunna. What's the difference between Takashi 69 and Gunna? Well, long before Takashi 69 ever went to court, they had announced to the world that he would be cooperating. Right? But besides that fact, Takashi 69 was in a crew of dudes that he didn't like and they didn't like him. They had kidnapped him, they fucked his girl, and all of this stuff. None of this excuses right. But you gotta understand that there is a difference between the likes of a rat like Takashi 69. And a miserable piece of shit like Gunna. Young Thug was, young, was Gunna's role model. They got the same hairstyle for God's sakes. They talk like each other. They got matching tattoos. He brought him in and changed his life. Gunner was just a quiet kid in the, in the studio while all the other guys was loud and rapper and boisterous. Young Thug saw in Gunner something. Heard him, listened to him, gave him an ear and gave him a shot. Takashi 6 9 had his own road to success. See, the Bloods, they just gave him street cred. See, Young Thug Gave Gunna everything. And he looked at him like a brother. And they called him king. And they looked at him like a brother. So that's why I would beg of y'all to please stop disrespecting Takashi 6 9 and comparing him to a piece of shit snake like Gunna. Who would lay down and sleep next to you. Who would eat at the table with you. Who would be around your family and your children. And then stab you in the back. Takashi didn't stab anybody in the back. He was stabbed in the back. And his option was to... Speak against these people or keep his mouth shut and end up locked in a cage with the people that were trying to harm him. Young Thug has no harm for, for Gunna. YSL has no harm for Gunna. If Gunna ends up in jail locked up with YSL, he'd be treated like a king. Takashi was facing 40 years plus. Gunna wasn't facing anything. He honestly was not facing anything but maybe time served at best because RICO charge without any other crimes is not a charge. But anyway, those are my thoughts of a rambling mind. Y'all like, share, and subscribe. Drop comments down in the comment section, man, and I'm out.